how to convince employees that changes are needed? Okay. Um, it is uh, the organization's responsibility, especially the top management, to convey the importance of change which has to happen in the organization. Uh, one thing is by designing a very good communication system where this communication uh, reaches all, all to all employees, uh, explaining why change is required. The second point is what are the benefits the company would gain and also the employees would gain. And what will happen if you don't change? So you also share uh, what would be the demerits if people are not willing to change. So that's how you convince your employees for change. So this is very important uh, task when you are employing some change management approaches. Yeah. And what, what happens if we try to resist change? See, the resistance to change, I always say that uh, mm, it is like do or die. So either you change or you don't change, but if you don't change, you don't survive. Because the outside world is phenomenally, exponentially changing, and if the organization is not changing and the people are not changing, the survival of the organization become a big question. So the resistance to change is always a challenge. But then, as I said earlier, you have to convince your employees, and then how to overcome resistance is a real big matter. And then you have to create ambassadors uh, who would go and attack on this resistance, convince people that this is very important. So creating change ambassadors, change agents, internal change agents. So there are several approaches which you can adopt to resist change. This is very important.